Hi, I'm Carl Frederick, and I'm a postdoctoral fellow at the National Institute of Health. I like to think of DNA as the mastermind architect that tells our cells how to build the proteins they need to function and survive. However, this description skips over a crucial step that first turns DNA into a similar molecule called RNA. That RNA is then used to create proteins in a process called translation. In this way, RNA acts like a blueprint for proteins drawn up by the DNA architect. Our cells are constantly translating RNA into proteins, even when we're just a developing embryo in our mother's womb. But the RNA in an embryo changes as a woman gets older. In fact, that might be one of the reasons why older women often struggle with infertility. My research explores how RNA influences the health of an embryo. I specifically study a process called RNA tailing, which adds chemical tails to RNA molecules, kind of like the way an architect might add a footnote to a blueprint. Specific types of tails change the way RNA molecules are translated into proteins, and this can affect the way an embryo develops. I've already identified a variety of cellular construction workers that build RNA tails, so now I'm trying to figure out which ones make specific types of tails and attach them to RNA in a mother's eggs. I'm also examining how factors like a mother's age affect the tails that get attached. Once we learn more about how cells pin the tails on RNA, we might be better equipped to create RNA-based therapies that help women get and stay pregnant so they can build their families in the way they want to.